lead when George Albert shot deceived Robertson but struck the post. St Johnston then stunned the capacity crowd by going in front themselves. The ball broke to Alan Kernahan and the central defender gave Andy Gorham no chance with a sweetly struck drive. But Rangers were back on level terms before the interval. Ian Durant fed Loudrop and although Ali McCoyce missed the cross, Marco Negri was on hand to score. Only the Italians' third goal in 1998, but it's 36th of what has still been a remarkable season. Rangers clinched the game in the second half with a stunning effort. The ball lashed in by Jonas Tern as the Swede emulated Kernahan's opener. Like all good strikers, Marco Negri tried to claim he'd got the final touch, but this one goes down as Tern's goal. And then a historic moment, what turned out to be the last appearance of Paul Gascoigne in a Rangers jersey. His time at Ibrox was never dull, there were clearly incidents the club could have done without. But surely no one would argue that, on his day, Gascoigne is one of the game's great entertainers. He tried to leave the Rangers fans with just one last memory. But after a great run, his final shot was saved easily. Nevertheless, Rangers had won what was clearly a vital game.